Hello, YouTube. We have just started this game, and we're going to replace this hand. Uh, this can get another resource, and we'll most likely be able to play this on two pitching. Yeah, keep that. Is this going to stay here? If this stays here, we're restarting the client. If they, like, are actually here. Okay, they're actually here. Well, that didn't take long. Good job, Hex. something out of whack on my monitor and now this looks all wrong to me. Alright, much better. <clears throat> well that's definitely a card we could have drawn. Oh, it's so saturated and weird. any of the resources we need. I mean, like with a ruby, we get to Doombringer them out of the game, so it's kind of whatever. Oh my god. So we want to get a Sapphire here. Just loot. So dead. I'd like to draw a ruby source. I'd like to not die this turn. <laughs> These would all be wonderful. Just, just the bestest. Just the bestest. Okay, that's seven. <laughs> A little more than seven. Can't win here. That's seventeen. He has another pomegranate. We're dead. That's still just seventeen. I mean, we're we're dead, but not actually dead. You know. <laughs> I'm not gonna play that because it shows him that we have Ruby. I almost did though. So he thinks he thinks we're a reanimator deck, probably. <clears throat> but I'm okay with that. Bring in interaction for card draw. like to test a thing. Okay, so my chat's working today, so I can close that thing. I hope. 
I hope that's the idea. Uh, we'll go first this time. We can certainly keep this. Turn to Briny Ray, pitching, scour the archives. Actually, we might just pitch the uh, draw. No, wait. You can't. You can't demonic tutor on the first scour. You have to do it on the second or later. So yeah, we can just pitch scour. Which of the wishing well? Okay. Ruby. Okay, that's a good draw. Some interaction. <sighs> Next time we can pitch this to Briny Ray, we can return to Cinder a thing. Plan to Mordrum Skip. We might just actually use this, depending on what they play. Scars War is a great draw. I'm actually gonna pitch this drop. pinch of like, do I want blood more than I want my second ruby for this Scars of War? I'm gonna get second ruby, because I think Scars is really good here. I'm just gonna kill this. I have less chance of reanimating now, because I didn't get blood. And I'm gonna hold up Return to Cinder. That's a card I haven't seen in a long time. Kill it, Dad. Okay. Double return to cinders. Okay. Oh, this has been awkward. This has been very awkward. target troop with flight in their deck, but if this lives a turn cycle, bleh, it's very good for us. Bleh, bleh, bleh. Okay. I don't have a thing I want to reanimate. Um, hmm. Okay. 
That's good. All right, all right. So we get to ditch this call to voice, and then more to skip to back next turn. Unless they 16 ball us here, which is unsettling, unsettlingly possible. Source, right? Yeah. Oh, no, it didn't. Okay. Oof. One is not none. I tell you what. I tell you what. Higher than zero. Twenty you question mark? Yeah, twenty you. <laughs> Thank you. I like my title. I worked really hard on it. <laughs> How do we beat... I mean, we beat him how we just beat him, right? Yeah. Do I want another excruciate, maybe? Mediocre title. Yeah, well... Mediocre title for a mediocre player. I think this is still fine. What is this? This is... This is Reanimator. You should be familiar with it, mister. <laughs> Who has robo coils? And why do I care? <laughs> yeah, this is um, not my 75, I will say. <laughs> Just reaching out and touching Mustache's heart. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I'm so glad my chat's working today. That was really annoying yesterday. Alright. Gotta win game three on the draw. Decent. hand. I mean... It has these three cards, which seem really good in this matchup. I'm gonna keep it. Couple ice. Cool. That's good too. Um, hmm. Let's see. If I fate weave a resource, gets me closer to scars. If I fate weave a non-resource, I can start doing things. I think I'm just gonna fate weave a resource here. I think we have enough time to figure out our resources properly.
Yeah, we do. Look at that. Plenty of time. Now we'll go non-resource. Move up, return to sender. Probably cycle one of these. Maybe I should. Uh, maybe I should have done another resource just so we can have five here. And what is this? Sure. not a ruby, but that's a good card. Uh, that did make these awkward, though. That was a bad idea. I shouldn't have done that. Uh, so, yeah. Go ahead and play one, cycle the other one for blood. Hmm. That's good there. <laughs> and they drew a resource too. They drew two resources. So they have Turbulence in their deck, but this card is great, so I don't care. <laughs> uh, in response to any removal, just ditch this. Probably gonna be able to... yeah, there it is. Maybe it, uh, mm. It's fine. We're gonna draw a resource here. It's fine, guys. It's fine. It's perfectly fine. Come on, resource. Come on, non-slow resource. Thank you. Thank you for, for playing. Excruciate whatever they play this turn. They didn't draw a resource, so their hand is all gas. Let's, let's spin the wheel here. Meh. I think we're past that point then. If we kill this, he's gonna take two from these, and then this will be lethal. Yeah. Oh wait, 
wait, no, he doesn't take one from that. Haha, -ha, JK. That's not how cards work. That's not how cards work at all. Never. I'm still basically dead here. Reanimate Seeker, clear his board, swing it for 10. felt good when like I know how to play it I will admit that there are a lot of times I don't know how to play it having a good night. Sure, your caravan's very happy. Hmm, yeah, that's kind of awkward. He's gonna make two troops here of differing... Uh, yeah. Cost. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> That's good to hear. Ooh, never mind. Never mind, we found the I win button. <laughs> we found the I win button. God, this, this deck is dumb. <laughs> this deck is so dumb. <laughs> Uh All right, dead on attack. Your turbulent turbulence was it? Yeah, free wins are very fun. Your turbulence was a good reserve card, but you're just dead. Cool. Oh, got my third grapes of wrath. Construction rank zero. Yeah, no one's higher than me. Oh crap, I meant to change my battle board. <laughs> Ooh, Mill, you say? Well, we beat Mill yesterday, which was good. Uh, but, 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 Seems great. Actually, the Mill game yesterday was the best game I've played in a long while. Um, this hand isn't as good as I originally said. Because this remnant is a little bit awkward since I want a briny ray on two. I'm gonna fate we have a resource here because of that. So we might draw like a, a well or a, a remnant of innovation. And that'll forgive me a little bit for for this awkwardness. Good, good, they didn't mill us on turn one. Close. You were close. Yeah. What? Okay. That was really weird. Uh, okay. I was gonna be very upset if I wasn't allowed to play that card. <laughs> that was that was a new one. I was like, "What? Why is it back in my hand? What just happened?" Everything's fine. Uh... 
No idea. But that's the only card you've seen do it, huh? Okay, discard here, draw a card. Discard here, draw a card. Oh, that's beautiful. That's what I love to see. This card's great. It's gonna, gonna go get us a... <laughs> no. We'll hold on to that for a bit. But I wouldn't be surprised if I eventually look for a blood source there. Uh, okay. I'm just in the market to never let that stay on the board. Just never ever let that stay there. Um, hmm. Part of me wants to play Nameless Drought to pitch the drop. Another part of me wants to fate weave a resource to the top so we can loot away these two resources for better ones. I'm kind of in the market for that. Because if I get a blood, then I can play voice next turn. And if I get a blood, then um, Mortrum's Gift is online. But like, playing this just like gives me a free loot. Oh, I have a free loot right there. Ha 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 ha. That's funny. C can we... Cycle this one first. Okay, so that's a blood source. Which is perfect. It's also perfect. Alright. Okay. scour and some resources that's fine i think we're past voice now don't do it again don't do it again oh okay um what are we at we're at 10 so yeah we can definitely mill five don't want them drawing anything Ooh, there goes a caw they're dead next turn to orchard's gift so sweet um yeah sure what are they gonna kill this one too or what's happening here i'm confused there it is all right caught in there? Jeez. Don't do it. Yeah! I was like, oh, this is gonna be awkward because I gotta do the thing. And I didn't have to at all. Uh, Nameless Truths was good the last time I played against this deck. Uh, Return to Cinder is pretty medium. I guess Verdict is okay. I played Halt last time, but maybe it should just be Verdict. I think Excruciate can go as well. Just have Primordial Sabretooth as our removal. I think that's fine. Like, the only 
card I can think of that I'd want Return to Cinder on is Vampire Prince, and... Hmm. I think this is fine, though. Nameless Truths was so good. Especially when you steal one of their cards and you're just like, haha, thank you. Thank you for contributing to my cause. Alright. Sure. Alright. Get Ruby here. Into their turn, we'll cycle this for blood. And our resources will be set for the entire game. That's pretty awesome. Go, Gadget, Briny Ray. Oh, please don't hero fall my Briny Ray. Oh, please don't hero fall my Briny Ray. Uh, don't do it. Okay. I'm okay with that one. Okay with that one, friend. Whew. I do declare. No. Ditched one of my Mordrum's gifts. Again, I'm not close to any of the scary numbers here. Alright, and starting to turn, bearing, if there are 20 or more, we're at 6. This would put us at 11. So. Yeah. Didn't hit a Doombringer cut, unfortunately. going through in my mind here is if I want to even scribe this turn. I could scour for a verdict, which means next turn I'd be able to scribe with verdict backup. That sounds pretty good, actually. Uh, or I could get Doombringer Cobb, but I don't have Mordrum's Gift, and that means I'm saying, yeah, I'm just gonna get right here. Not Theorize Verdict. Okay. Alright. 
Do I already have a Doombringer Ka in my crypt? No, I do not. So I'm gonna hold on to this though. Just keep that in mind. The reason I'm holding on to it is because you can have Brink of Madness, and so ditching this now when I can't reanimate it or do anything like that would be bad. Alright, now I have a Doombringer Ka in my crypt. He didn't immediately Brink of Madness it, so that's a start. Certainly a start. Okay, I have exactly one piece of interaction. Here we go. <laughs> There's my one piece of interaction. Take it away. Skips. One, two, three, four. Hmm. Nameless truths. Got a dip, but it will leave stream on. Oh, thank you. back in our hands. Let's see, they've been through three hero falls. That's so funny. Huh. We can put a Mordrum Skift in our hand? Yeah, okay. Uh, Mordrum Skift. Uh, doesn't matter. This card's good. This card is very good. It's too bad I couldn't get to like a basic action and a quick action, because then I could have gotten verdict as well. <sighs> They've been through three hero falls, though. Oh, they're gonna just draw again? Jeez. They're looking for that fourth hero fall. Casualty. Okay. We win. Thanks. I don't know why I'm looting. Like, legitimately don't know why I'm looting. Cast a, a seeker. On one, apparently. Hmm. Oh, that must have been from the first game. That's awkward. in 
this thing, sure. Losing to that thing very quickly. Unless something ridiculous happens to... want to draw extra cards, so yeah. Are we dead? Oh, they got a scour for it. Scour for a scour, you say? Okay. Yeah. yeah, okay. Well, we just didn't get there, but... Maybe I want to cut verdicts for halts because they're easier to cast, so they're easier to hold up. And most of the things I care about are quick speed anyway. He will go first this time. Uh, what are we looking at here? Um, hmm. I think you can mulligan aggressively in very matchups like this, but I kind of like this hand. I'll try it. Sources, huh? All them resources. <clears throat> Oof. I just want to take them off that fate leave. Ooh, we hit a hero fall too. And an unravel? Yes, doing it. Uh, yeah. Now we're gonna set ourselves up for the same thing to happen. Oh wait, this gets milled. Duh, I knew that. Oh, perfect. Just how I drew it up. Well, they have Scour in their own den. Huh. They already hit that thing. Scribe out. Oh, he's nowhere near a hero fall, actually. So I will play this scribe out in that case. Drop him. Hit a brink. That's good. Slowly picking apart his removal by milling him. <laughs> Every time it builds a doom removal, it's so good. Big fatty. Big fatty boom. Mordrum's gift. That, that'll do pig. Oh, he's got Brink of Madness. Like, 10 out of 10, he's got Brink of Madness in his hand. There's one there, but like... <laughs> through, 
through the potential brink. you into me I want to fight you oh wait 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 hold on I can't fight you yet I remembered this time I remembered this time I don't know why it's on this one where do we want it though let's go here the hexing is going pretty well we are currently 2 and 0 on this run just be beat a berry player in game three by saying, well, you have one resource open, but do you have it? <laughs> and just going for Mordrum's Gifts. Works every time. <laughs> or 60% of the time, it works every time. Yeah. Two and oh, what was the other deck we played against? Oh, it was a uh, Mono Wild Lady Avalanche Momentum Aggro. No, it wasn't Mono Wild. It was Mono Ruby Momentum Aggro sort of thing. Got there. So one, two, three, four. I'm currently six and two with the deck, and I only started playing it last night. So. Pretty happy with that. Up to 72 after falling all the way down from not doing anything to like 90 something. Inactivity will do that to you, huh? I'm not like in a rush to get top 64 though. I don't know how I feel about playing a CCS. <laughs> First, we will. Uh, this hand, a little awkward on the resources. Need Sapphire pretty badly. Right. Sounds okay. Turn two, kill your dude. Turn three, this into loot. Yeah. Maybe I should put non resource on top because of that, since I have, but no. I'm putting resource on there just in case so I can potentially cast voice. Libations, I. <laughs> What what a turn one. Uh 
probably shouldn't laugh. I'm definitely not going to saber tooth a 1 1. What? Spiders? What? Is this? Okay. It was created by that. I was like, what? what's happening? Okay. Uh, yeah, go ahead. It's all you, boss. <laughs> it was. It was a really good turn one. You made two cards. <laughs> uh, this has momentum, which is annoying. You don't diss a turn one lackey. I think I just did. All right. Uh, I don't mind getting pinged, but let's just take him off of that. Uh, then we will play this out. I will right, play this out. And eventually make blood with this so we can play voice next turn. We'll get there. Playing the dropout means that uh, this remnant will be painless. Effing good. Oh, I didn't even see that. Alright, you have a 2-3 now. You've doubled your clock! I'm scared. <laughs> I'm scared and cold, hold me. I'm being so mean today, I'm sorry. <laughs> I shouldn't be mean. Uh, yeah. Let's loot this drop of chaos away. Let's loot this scour the archives away. You played a big scary troop. This thing has a lot of, of relevant text on it. How is this not unique? Is my question. Like, does. To Indrider have multiple voices? That would be really cool if that's why it's not unique. But, like, come on now. What do you do? Okay. Wait. Okay. Blood Splash? No. I'm gonna stop asking questions. Block. Buddy. Oh, buddy. Just, just, just gonna get this out of the way. the combo set up two different ways. If they go to kill this, then I will pitch the Doombringer Caw. Well, either way, I'm pitching the Doombringer Caw. It's just... Well, no, I'm, I'm more just gifting regardless of what I do. What am I talking about? Yeah. You sure are dead next turn. Why not discard for plus... Oh, because I... I don't know. It doesn't... It's irrelevant at this point. <laughs> and... I did it. And now they're dead.
card does a lot of dumb things. This card does a lot of dumb things. Uh, this card seems good. Return seems alright. I was gonna say, oh wait, he has an X3, but he didn't have an X3 because he randomly made an X3. Excruciate's a little slow and a couple of some theorize. Yep. Yeah. Just like your average aggro package, basically. Confirm. Do you concur? I don't know what you're saying. Do you concur? Stuffy doll. Well, while that message is up, let me see a thing. So I kind of want to change that. So this hand, let's see, has ruby and sapphire, has a couple scours to find whatever we're missing, doesn't have a blood, but we have a scribe, so we can play the scour for our third resource so that we can activate our champ power, and basically the world is our oyster, question mark? It's a really weak keep, but I'm keeping it anyway. That's an 01. If I ever saw one. Okay. That helps us not have to look for a resource, at least. Keep this in hand. Yeah. All right. This is 
dumb. What? What? Huh? All right, let's just draw a scar support here. User, God. Does that work? Yeah, okay. Okay. That took way too long. Let's get back in the game. Alright, so let's kill this. resource on top. Then we'll loot away this Doombringer. I was going to say next turn we can scour for Morshroom's Gift, but no need. Alright, opponent. You have this two turn cycles to kill me. That goes a long way to kill me, honestly. You take six. Down to seven. We get one blocker next turn, but we go to five. So if this gets crush, it's a problem. Oh wait, we go to five, which means these kill us. Crap. We goofed. Um. I can... We goofed. <laughs> Definitely goofed. Because uh, if I play this, I just die to these. Even if this blocks. He has to have a resource to kill me. And that... It's a very low threshold. So my only non-painful blood sources are roots. Three. So that doesn't work either. If I played this, I have four resources and I could kill the thing. pretty dead here, so I'm just gonna pretend that they don't have a resource. Because this is always a 5-5? Five five? No, it's a 2-2. Two 2-3. Two. Two, we can take 3. Yeah, so we can take 3, but if he plays a resource or if he plays another troop, we're just dead. Play should help us a lot. Being on 
on the play should definitely help. My, my mistake there was being distracted while playing the complicated deck. Probably kept a hand that was too slow as well. We did end up with the combo in hand, but again, it was like a turn or two too slow. Maybe I should have killed the the boon batch or whatever. I'm not sure because I killed uh, righteous whack shot instead. That might have been the better line, I'm not sure. I can't remember what their momentums were at. Honestly, I'm just playing so I can get these, these uh, three random standard legal cards. Because I know in my heart of hearts it's going to be a Doom Ringer call, a voice, and a scrap. And then I can sell them for profit. <laughs> that would be the sickest three random cards ever! Thank you for asking. Uh, no. <laughs> Speaking of slow hands that don't do anything for- oh my god. Oh my god. Kills us, doesn't it? This is how you lose to gold, lose to gold, lose to gold. All right, sure. It's got a scars in it. It's got a potentially castable briny ray on two. We can pitch this doombringer. We get to fate weave another resource. Trying to be optimistic here, chat. Dear YouTube viewers, my goal was just to be optimistic. All right, Ruby. That'll do, pig. That'll do, pig. Like... Yeah. I mean, I'm kind of doing it here, just for the record. I have removal, I have a sweeper, just need a second ruby. I got, I got filter fish going. I'm gonna be aggressive here. Just like kill this. I can cast. Gonna be smart. Yeah. No, 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 no. Don't you dare. I want this to make sapphire or blood, but I also just want to hit my resource drops, so I'm just playing this for no value. It sucks, but when you draw a four card hand, what can you do? Eventually, Filter Fish will just draw his cards. So, like, oh no! 
it's on the line, chat. Scribe of the Flayed Man is very good against Chastise, right? Yeah. Alright, just need a Sapphire. Show me that Sapphire! One time, dealer. One time, Sapphire. You let me down. Scars of War seems slightly more important than other things right now, so I got the, re the thresholds for that. Although I do have this, so if I get a blood, that's probably better. I don't know. Moon Call Ceremony. Take seven. Oh my god. Uh, a one four that gains health. Oh, he skipped. Okay. We win on the mold of four. We win on the mold. Okay, I will be right back. We'll hold on to your butts. I made a very loud popping noise when I just did that. I think I may have broken it. <laughs> Whoops. There it goes again. What's making that noise? 
Alright then. Well, that's weird. Pretty good, we're at 3 0 now, so slowly, slowly figuring this out. Granted, I did just play someone playing like a deck, <laughs> just cards. I own these cards, here they are. Nope, that's not the button I wanted. Admittedly, they did beat us uh, in game two because I was distracted and dumb. But, yeah. Is this all singles? This is all singles. Are they, like, testing a deck for singles night? No reserves. Okay. I see. Now I feel like a bully. Thank you. <laughs> Maybe they got confused. Oh, we're playing against Curtis, huh? I wonder what build of this deck this is. Um, sure. Again, the resources end up being a might bit awkward. But... I need to get Sapphire here, right? Yes. I think this is a keep anyway because we get briny fish to pitch scour to. I note that you dropped a game to that. I said I did. I said I was very distracted and dumb. <laughs> I admit when I'm I'm bad at things, okay? So we just need resources now? And like a fatty in our crypt? Rip. That was a weird no attack there. Uh... Try shard versus try shard, I see. He's gaining so much life and killing all my things. And a fate weave, a resource here. Don't really care about that. Got nothing in my crypt. Oracle song. Legit Oracle song. Wow. We divination now, boys. Ugh, that is not what I was looking for at all. Playing this out in case uh, I am able to draw a blood resource, then I'll be able to loot with my champ power, as opposed to with Nameless Drought, I don't get a charge. I am 
midnight gathering, you say. This is so dumb, but I'm gonna scour for blood here. It goes into my deck. Why does it go into the deck? Because <laughs> um, this can get pretty scary. I could loot away this Nameless Drought. If I want to discard whatever I'm going to reanimate. Alright. I'm just going to pass the turn. Psychic Ascension, you say? What an interesting pile of cards you're playing, Curtis. What an interesting pile of cards. So you just gotta get diamond here, yeah. save this in case I cast this at some point. It's a good thing to discard. Look at that pupper. Such a happy pupper. It's voids, right? Yeah. Yep. Or he just... No, he can't just kill us, but he can tin us. Or he can void this. Huh. Alright. So we have outs then? No. We had outs. We had outs. So he's got this and the seals target. <laughs> Try and discard this card. He's got a glory, midnight gatherer, some blazes, psychic ascension. <laughs> Free information, folks. Uh, yeah, we're dead. kill his bigger troops, whereas Cinder can't really. His smaller troops will die to, like, any of the removal I have anyway. Halt gives me a little bit of protection from his removals. Uh, his removals. That's the word I'm looking for. Try that.
<sighs> we were pretty close that game, but he got us. He got us good. First again. Um, <sighs> see, these are the hands that I don't know what to do with. Like, I'm pretty sure this is a good hand, but it looks really slow to me. I don't have anything to pitch to Briny Ray, but he's just value anyway. I can fate weave a resource to the top, which will help us get to ex ex excruciate. That's the word. I keep calling it extricate, don't I? Anyway, excruciate. And then we can eventually Mordrum Skift. We have two of them. Try it. We will see. Like with linear decks, you just look at your hand and it's either yes or no. With this deck, there are lines to think about. Gotta think ahead, man. It's so funny after playing aggro for so long, like seeing this used to tilt me all to hell, and now I'm just like, hmm. Like, what am I looting here? I guess I could loot this way, but, like, I want my resources. I wish it was actually loot and not rummage. Extricate again. Or excruciate again. Blah, 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 blah. Midnight Girder. Offer this trade. Just need something to put in the crypt. Sure. Gonna get sapphire here. Already have our blood. That'll that'll do, pig. gift. Gravebane file. Ah! <laughs> Only drew a backup plan, question mark? Start of your turn if this is in your hand. Oh. oh, at the start of your turn. Okay. Oh, and it has runic. That's interesting. 
man. I almost brought in Jouncing Charge, too. Or Jouncing Carnage. There we go. Yep. Use next turn, I can play this and this. Ay, ay, ay. This card. Why wasn't I thinking about this? I never think about this. I wonder if... I guess next turn I can just go for the gift since I have two and then he can pop it and then I can set up the gift next turn. Can even sweeten the pot by uh, here, let's sweeten the pot a little bit. I should have gone for it sooner. I had to. I don't know why I was... Whatever. Just so I don't clash with other big things that are going to be happening soon, I will play one more match, and you guys can watch Dungeon Masters of Entrath or something. I kind of want to play Slay the Spire, because it looks really cool. But I also don't want to pay 16 duck, bucks. Ducks? Yes. I don't have 16 ducks to give to the game at the moment. Or however much it costs. I don't really have any money. That list seemed interesting. Sadly missed a bit of the games. Yeah. Uh, here, let me pull it up for you really quick. Grave Bane files. Oh, I hate you too. Jeez. Uh, we will go first. Another control deck, you say? Sure. Sapphire, pass the turn, this can get blood, these can get ruby, whatever. Hey, what's up? Alright, so we're playing against another uh, ruby. 
Ruby Sapphire Diamond deck. What did I say this was getting? Blood? Blood. Blood. Okay. Uh, go ahead and play this out. I should have done that, I guess. That's fine. In theory, this is a good play. Ooh. Mamma Mia. Here I go again. My, my. Okay, I'll stop. Just missing a card. One card. It's not it. It's not. That's not the card I was talking about. It's also not the card I was talking about. Okay, they have their three shards. I'm gonna use two cards. I'm gonna use two cards over something I actually don't care about. Because I already have this. Play this out. Play another voice in the past turn. Just looking to reanimate. Please, friend, let me reanimate. I see. to play this. It's got no resources open. Play this. Loot. Perfect. And I can play this out. Alright. Alright, that was sweet. And we got Briny Wraith that we can play things off of too. Timing restrictions on Scribe are kind of weird, but you can do really cool things. Yep, he's dead, Jim. Uh, awkward. I didn't. I haven't been picking up a second Ruby, else I would be able to just cast that.
Perfect. So I kept the ruby ice because I want the second ruby in case this wardrobe gift goes awry. We'll be able to then just play this. Runic upheaval, fine. both sides of the combo that game. Alright, these were hurt by it. These look good, though, because I can kill Darkheart. I'm okay with that. Plus, if they have a Grave Bane, Grave Bane file. Uh, I want Pulse, though. Um, digging is good. Maybe I don't want Johnson Carnage. I'd rather have Protection. I don't want to get burned out by another Gravebane vial. Just draw Scribe then, nerd. Okay, jeez, calm down. So rude. Uh... Maybe I can, like, take out an Excruciate for Carnage? That seems fine. Go team. What we got? Try this hand on the draw. Yep. Okay, that makes it a little bit better, actually. So we we'll get Ruby with this. These can be our sapphires. This can be our blood. We can just scour next turn. Great Bane Vial. Of course, every time I have it set up to do the one thing, it's Grave Bane Vial. Every time I don't have it set up to do. Also shuts off our demonic tutor. <laughs> what can I put in my crypt that will make them want to pop that vial? I'm not sure. Casting these. I'm gonna get a voice next turn. Do I want to loot? I want to keep. I want to keep this around because it's just really good. Yeah. I think we just pass here.
Draw a resource. They had one in hand. It's awkward. Champ power just says draw a card. Yeah. Where's your skip? <laughs> This thing dead. He keeps. <laughs> Wait, what does he have as the ruby? This deals double damage. Okay. That's funny. So. I'm going to set up a turn where it looks like they've got me. I'm going to attempt to Mortrum's Gift. So I have to sacrifice this Seeker. But I have a backup. Hopefully they don't too. Should have gone resource because I didn't play this. Yeah, I probably should have gone resource there. Whoops. Wow. Wow, their hand is full. I just realized how much damage we've been taking from these, uh. <clears throat> what you call them? Vertic of Evils. Yep, like this is gonna five us. Oh, and it does double damage. That's cute. Are we dead? Yeah, we're dead. GG. Got us off Runic Upheavals. Again, just a turn too slow. So let's be on the play. Ooh. That optimal upheaval. <laughs> Yeah. Alrighty. Trim a gift. Am I?
I'll just trim a target. Try and jouncing carnage our way into the hearts of Americans across the world. <laughs> what? That doesn't even make sense. Why is he talking? Tell him to shut up. We will go first. Wow. Try it. I gotta learn. <laughs> Thank you. I gotta learn what a good keep is in this deck. I. This hand is iffy. But, like, it has Ruby, Blood, Blood Sapphire. It has the Scribe, which is a slightly better plan, but he's gonna just remove it. I think we have time to set up our resources a little bit against this deck, so that's what I'm going for here. Yeah, let's hurt yourself. Okay. So we'll get blood here, pass the turn. EOT will get sapphire, and this is sapphire. not going for this plan this time around, so that's fine. Uh... Oh, I should have played... <sighs> such an empty... I should have played that. I should have played Scribe. really should play Scribe. Uh, okay. You remove, opponent. Wink. Please don't kill my guy. 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 Grave Bane Vile, nerd. <laughs> okay. Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, but that felt really good. Oh, that's perfect. It's 8 o'clock. Well, I'm gonna call it there. It's a short stream, but I'm... I feel kind of weird recently, so any stream is a good stream, right? Um, tomorrow, I will be on at 8 p.m. Ugh. I just got tired just thinking about that. Uh, which means now. Whatever time is on your clock now, this is when I'll be starting tomorrow. Uh, if you haven't already, follow me here. Follow me on Twitter, at MartyPunker. You can catch my VODs on YouTube. Uh, hello and goodbye, YouTube, by the way. 